Hey everyone, welcome back. In this video, I'll be showing you how to wash your face and open the hive door in Deepwoken. If you haven't already, please like and subscribe. It's free to do so and really helps me out. Let's get straight into the video. You are going to want to go to Songseeker. Songseeker is through the Etrus gates all the way going straight to the other gates. And once you pass through, they will close behind you, teleporting you into a new server. You will need an oath, so if you don't have one, go get one. At the moment I am just past the gates, heading to the place where I can spawn boats. Once you have a boat, follow where we go. On this island, we just stopped by as a little detour just to see what our preferred bell progression was for our accounts. I got PvP preferred. Head this way and use your glider to get across. Go past the big green gate. Head down after you kill whatever is in your path, then follow where we go. Head up the green jump pad, and you can either kill the threshers or run past them. We killed them for free XP. But sometimes, stone knights and alpha sharkers spawn here as well, so be careful about that. Head up the green jump pads until you get to the top. You may need a vertical mobility move. If you don't have one, then try to find another way around using your glider.
Head through the cave. There are two chest spawns there. Through here is a shrine of mastery. This is where you go if you want to change your points like Eridation, Vitality, Proficiency, and Song Chan. Go through this place. You can usually just smack the wall with an AoE move and it will break, but it was bugged in our server. If you want, you can server hop until it is open for you, like what we do. Keep heading through, then you will come to a drop. It is pretty far down, so try to take as little full damage as possible. There is a giant spider widow thing here. Try not to do it by yourself, as it will probably kill you pretty easily. Either be a high power or have someone else with you. If you have someone else, it will basically be free XP and items. Head through the place the big spider was blocking and go up. Head up this pillar and over these parts. Keep heading through the path and drop down. There will either be a normal thresher or a king thresher. King threshers are really annoying. Go through the door and head left. There will be another thresher there. The white borders of the screen indicate a void zone. This means that if you die here, you get sent straight to the depths, no matter what your health bar's color is. So basically, just don't die. Don't fall off here. It instantly kills you. Interact with the fountain and then wash your face. The big green door from earlier should now be open and you can access this teleporters to use as quick transportation. Head back out, you have finished washing your face. If you want a quick way out, just reset character to respawn at your set spawn point, which is most likely the Gates of Song Seeker. This doesn't take away any life. If you want to get back through the door, follow us. The green jump pads negate full damage. Use one of them and then fall to the bottom to get down really fast.
go back the way we came, up this rock and across. As you can see, the door is gone now. Here is the teleporter to Great Hive approach. Here are the three teleporters. Don't ask me which is which because I don't know. If you enjoyed or found this video helpful, please like, subscribe and hit the notification bell to get notified when we make a new video. Thanks for watching and see you all next time.